Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Kendall V. If you don't know who I am, I am Kendall V. And I am so excited for this video. I will be doing an apartment tour of some of the hottest Atlanta apartments. Y'all know I had to pause it because of what was going on. So before I go out there, I wanna make sure I make my green smoothie because I wanna make sure I have all my nutrients. My immune system is boosted up. I took all my vitamins. So I'm about to show you guys this super food powder that I got from Teeny Blanche as well as this cup. This green super food powder is the truth, y'all. I used this yesterday and it has 16 nutrients in it. 16, not one, not two. It has 16 nutrients in it. You can throw this into your smoothie. You can even throw it into your water, but Y'all know I'm a smoothie queen, so I got this Teamy Blends powder, and I'm gonna add it into my smoothie today. I had it yesterday, it made me feel so energized. I felt so good, my body was thanking me. If y'all want that, I highly encourage. I can give it to you guys for 25% off using my code right here. Go get y'all that. We should really be boosting our immune systems, making sure we're getting all of our nutrients during this time, and all you gotta do is use one scoop and you're done. Okay. I know I told you guys I was going to tour apartments in Atlanta, but that did not work out. I wasn't prepared. I didn't have any tours scheduled. So I said, why don't you tour your own apartment? I know you guys are waiting for it. So ignore what the intro said. Today I am showing you guys my new 2020 apartment and I'm super excited. I do want to let you guys know that it's not finished. I would probably consider this an unfurnished apartment tour because I haven't gotten all my furniture. So don't judge. Don't be in the comments talking mess because like I said, I have not gotten everything. This is my third weekend and I'm still buying my furniture. If you guys are ready, make sure you like this video. Make sure you subscribe and let's get into it. Right here, of course, is my entryway. This is my front door. I have my little peephole so I can see whoever is knocking on my door. And over here to the left when you come in, let me show you guys. Each time you open it, it makes this noise. How cute is that? So it makes that noise each time you open the door, which is amazing because if you're trying to come into my house, I'm going to hear you. So this is the little alarm system they already have inside my apartment. This is my alarm system right here. And you know, you just turn it on when you leave each time. Super duper convenient. It came with the apartment and I love that. Of course, these are my light switches. To the right, I have a, I guess it's like a coat closet where you can put miscellaneous or even a storage closet. I'm using it as a storage closet right now because I have a lot of winter clothes and I don't know where to put them. I mainly just have an extra clothes and winter clothes that I didn't want to put into my closet. I do want to make this kind of like where people put their shoes when they first come in because I do want to implement a no shoes policy in my house. So I'm going to tell my guests to put their shoes in these little slots. All right, so to the right, right after the storage closet is my bathroom. I love my bathroom. It is it is so so spacious and the lighting honey let's go this is my bathroom welcome to my bathroom It is so so spacious. I do want to get a like makeup chair right here to do my makeup. But of course, here's my toilet. And right next to it, I have this cute little trash can I got from Walmart. It's a marble trash can. It was only three dollars, three ninety-seven. It's huge, huge, huge. So 
It kind of also goes with my white and gray thing. I have not found a shower curtain that is long enough for this in store, so I have to order one. And I haven't got around to that either. I told you guys, this is why I was trying to weigh off on it because there's so many things I don't have yet, but it's okay. The mirror area, ooh, right across from the shower, this is the beautiful mirrors. I love, love, love all of these mirrors, honey. When I tell you, it really, you know, makes me want to do a lot more self-care than I have. Like, I just love being in my bathroom because, look, like, hey, Kennedy, what's up, Kennedy? Hey, Kennedy, hey, what's up, Kennedy? I love it. It's so high. It's so much storage, y'all. Like, the storage goes all the way down there, like, and then all the way to the other side, so. So now let's go on to the kitchen. Are you ready for the kitchen? All right, so right across from the bathroom is my beautiful, beautiful kitchen. I love my kitchen area. I So of course over here we have my microwave right over the stove. This is my flat top stove. I recently just got my oven dirty. I have to scrub it because there's no self clean button on this stove. That's the only thing I don't like. Yeah, I have a flat top stove. I'm so happy I have a flat top stove because I do not like the eyes and cleaning under the eyes and the gas stoves. I love a flat top stove. So. That's what I have. Then over here, I try to keep this area as minimal as possible. I don't want a lot of things on the counter. So this is just what I keep my utensils in. On this side of the stove, I usually always keep my wine of the week. This is my favorite wine. It's from Aldi's, $6.99. And then I have this cute little fake aloe vera plant. And behind it is a air wick that just ran out. Probably one of my favorite things about my apartment. It's LED lights over the desk area and over the stove. So at nighttime, I can just turn those on and I don't have to turn on any lights. I can just keep the LED lights on. Yes, honey, I love that. Look at that, dumb cute. What, dumb cute? <laughs> so much cabinet space, it's ridiculous. Over here is my seasoning cabinet and all of my oils and sauces and up there is like my healthy stuff. Over here, I keep my plates and such. I have like my plates and my cups. Up there, I keep my mug. More cabinet space. I need to go grocery shopping. I don't have the water thing on my fridge, but that's okay. So yeah, this is my freezer and my refrigerator. And then down here, I keep my few pots and pans that I have. I don't have many, but I have enough to cook what I need. My utensils and my knives and things. All right, now my sink ain't perfect because I am in the process of cleaning it. I have some dishes in the sink right now, but that's okay. This is my sink area where I wash my dishes. A really deep sink, which I love. And then my sink also has this. What? It can switch from that to this, which is really cool. So I like that. This time I have a pantry. I did not have a pantry at my last place, but it's still a lot of space. Over here, I have a laundry room. Now I've never had a laundry room. I'm lying. I definitely had a laundry room at my last place, but I didn't want to have to have a laundry room that was like out in the open because you can kind of hide your dirty clothes in here sometimes. So come on in here. Here I have more storage. I have some LED light bulbs because LED light bulbs help you save energy. So get you some. Over here is my washer machine. I have a piece of hair on it. This came with it. I'm so happy my place came with the washer and dryer included. And yeah, it's pretty nice. It's pretty freaking nice. You know, you guys know what. Oh my God. What happened to the dryer? More storage. I have the iron up here. Some sheets, microfiber towels for cleaning. These need to go in the bathroom because these are bath towels. But um, I have even more microfiber towels 
for cleaning. Okay, these are a necessity. If you don't have anything for your apartment, get some microfiber cleaning towels so you don't use paper towels and use all your paper towels. You gotta go buy some more. So that's there. Okay, bye bye laundry room, see you later. This is my desk area. Um, I haven't got a chair for this area yet. I really need to so it can motivate me. Over here we have another LED light so that when you're working, you got a lit area, you don't need a lamp. Um, this is where the AC is. I have some books here, some of my favorite books up here. So it's so much space, y'all. I wish y'all could see all this. Look, so much cabinet space. So never gonna run out of space. And then right over here on top of the desk, I haven't, you know, got this together yet. But these are decorations that I have to put up or either throw away. I'm not sure yet. Here's the hookah. Down there, I just have miscellaneous things I need to either throw away or put up have shopping bags down there too so I, i'm gonna get the area together that's the imperfect area that i'm still working on more doors more doors more doors so storage is endless i'm um, moving on past there this is just of course like a this is like where the heater and dryer thing is um, this is my bedroom. Over here is the bedroom. To the right is the living area. This is the TV. We decided to mount the TV and we need to get some cords to hide these cords because that's super ugly. But the TV is mounted. It's a 50 inch. This is the TV that I got from Walmart for like $250. So nice little 50 inch. I want to put LED lights around it and the whole five, so the living room is in the works. Don't worry, it's gonna be beautiful once I'm done. Cute little bar stools that I DIY myself. These were like some old, old stools that my mom had since probably I was like a baby, but I DIY them and I made them black and white, and I'm using them in here until I get, well, I don't know, I may keep them, I may not, but I really like them, they serve their purpose right now, and I have to, I really can add another bar stool because it's a huge bar area, but these two are working for now. This is my couch. I super duper love this couch. It's so spacious. It's not a sectional, but it has so much space like a sectional. Um, I have to put decorations up and get this area together, but I have this rug that I showed in my apartment hall. This is not going to be in here, but it's just in here for now. And then this is what I've been using as my table for now. Don't judge me, okay? Other side of my couch, I have this white cube that I had in my old room. Um, I have a picture of me down there. Beautiful windows. It has so much lighting when I open all these windows in the morning. And then also I like that I can See, I have screen windows so I can open up the windows to let some air in. This is our bedroom. I have super huge windows, so the natural lighting is amazing. They're all, I was gonna say they're almost floor to ceiling, but they're just really, really big windows. So when the windows are open, the lighting is so, so perfect. Here is my beautiful bed. I love this bed so much. It's so cute. It's so cute. I got it from Rooms to Go. Um, I just have this great comforter set that my mom got for me. So yeah, this is the bed. I love the detailing on my bed. It has these cute little, I guess, rhinestones or embellishments. I don't know what it is, but we decided to make the bed a little higher. So we got a, I think it's a box spring under there, but it's really, really thin. Here's my closet. I'm not going to show y'all too much of the closet, but it is a walk-in closet. This is my balcony. This is what I have out here right now. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to smash that like button. Make sure you are subscribed to stay along my journey of moving out at 22. Well, of my life after moving out at 22. I have an entire series that I'm still posting on daily. Just about daily. <laughs> so yeah, make sure you are subscribed and I'll see you beautiful in my next video. Bye, beautiful.